Hey guys! Welcome back to Digiber channel. Anyone who uses an iPhone would create a passcode to protect the device from prying eyes. But it's common that you forgot the passcode to unlock your iPhone. And eventually, after several attempts of entering the wrong passcodes, you will get an iPhone unavailable message on your iPhone screen, leaving you no access to get back into the device. In this regard, you'll have to recall the correct passcode, or reset your unavailable iPhone to regain access to the device. Today, in this video, we'll share with you four efficient ways to reset your unavailable iPhone, which are using Erase iPhone, Find My, iPhone Unlocker and iTunes. However, it's worth noting that, after the reset, the iPhone unavailable screen along with all the data will be removed. You can still restore the data from your backup if you have made one previously. Otherwise, your data will be lost permanently. Well, the first way to consider is using the Erase iPhone feature. It's one of the easiest methods to fix an iPhone unavailable screen, since you do not need a computer to do the reset. But your iPhone needs to run iOS 15.2 or later, and connect to stable network. Also, you should have your Apple ID and password in hand. To take this approach to remove the iPhone unavailable message, you need to firstly enter wrong passcodes to your iPhone in a row until the Erase iPhone option appears in the lower right of the iPhone unavailable screen. Then tap on it. When you are asked to confirm the reset, tap Erase iPhone again as a yes answer and sign out of your Apple ID by entering the password. Tap the same option as you did in the last step. Later your iPhone will get to erase itself. When it's done, the Hello screen will replace the iPhone unavailable screen. Now you can set up your iPhone from scratch or retrieve the data from your backup. Here comes to the second method you can use to reset your iPhone. That is using Find My in iCloud. You can use it when your iPhone isn't running iOS 15.2 or later, and the Erase iPhone option doesn't show up on the screen. However, to use this method, you'll need another device to open a browser, like a phone, a tablet, or a computer, no matter which brand it's of. More importantly, your iPhone should turn on the Find My iPhone option in the settings and enable network connection in prior. Here we will use a computer to show you how to fix your iPhone unavailable screen via Find My. To begin with, navigate to iCloud.com in a browser. Sign in with your Apple ID and password. Click Find iPhone in the menu. Above the map, click All Devices. Select the unavailable iPhone from the pull-down list. Hit Erase iPhone among the presented three options. Lastly, hit Erase to confirm the erasure. Soon afterwards, your iPhone will start the reset. And the iPhone unavailable screen will be removed. When it restarts, you can start the iPhone afresh or restore the data from the backup in iCloud by following the on-screen instructions. The third method we're going to talk about is using iPhone Unlocker. It's a safe and effective passcode removal tool that helps you erase lock screen passcode, as well as screen time passcode, or Apple ID and password. When your iPhone fails to connect the network, or you forgot the Apple ID password, it's a great option for you, as neither of which is needed when you use this tool. You can see more details and download the software from this website. It's also in the description below. Let's see how it works in steps. Firstly, launch iPhone Unlocker on your Mac or PC. Select Wipe Passcode and then hit Start. Next. Check this link to see how to activate your iPhone into recovery mode to make it detected. When it's recognized, confirm your device information as required and click Start to move on. Later, 
an iOS software that's appropriate for your iPhone will start to download. Wait for a few minutes. Once it's finished, you will see a pop-up window. Enter 0000 in the input box and hit unlock. Your iPhone will automatically start the reset then. After a while, the iPhone will reboot like a brand new device. The last way we will introduce to remove your iPhone unavailable screen is using iTunes. Before you use this this method, make sure you have a PC of Windows 10 or later with the latest version of iTunes installed, or a Mac of Mac OS 10.15 or later with Finder. If you don't have a computer like this, you may turn to the methods we talked before to reset your iPhone. We will now show you the steps on using iTunes to fix the iPhone unavailable issue in a Windows PC. Open iTunes first on your computer. And plug your iPhone into the PC. Make your iPhone enter recovery mode by the following steps. Quickly press and release the volume up button, and do the same to the volume down button, then press and hold the side button until you see the recovery mode screen. Once your iPhone gets into the recovery mode, a window will pop up asking you if you want to update or restore the device. Hit Restore. Hit Restore and Update Next. iTunes will then download a software. And when it's completed, your iPhone will get into the reset process. Now the annoying iPhone unavailable screen disappears. Well, this the end to today's video. Try to avoid getting an iPhone unavailable screen again by setting up a passcode that's easy to remember, and make it a habit to back up your data in case of further data loss. If you have any questions, feel free to ask and comment below. Also please hit the like button and subscribe to us for more latest videos. Thanks.